Hello everyone and welcome to Mad Father. This is an animated horror game that I um, watched someone play a while back uh, a few years ago and I thought it'd be a nice little game to start back on the channel. So, let's get right into it. Prologue. This game contains frightening elements. Young children in the fate of heart should refrain. From what I remember, it just kind of shows the credits, um, in the beginning. Well, all the credits are rolling. Um, funny story, when I was recording this, this is not my first time attempting to record this. I recorded this, uh, earlier today, and, um, a fire alarm went off in the middle of the recording, and so I didn't, like, continue the recording, just cut it out, so it kind of got messed up, and I was like, ah, oh, well, it's gonna start though. So, I played through a little bit of the game, not much. Um, but yeah, so right here is just, just enjoy the nice ones. Hello. This actually happens to be one of the um, first animated horror games I ever watched, and I'm actually very interested in these. Uh, I got this in a bundle with Misayo, Misayo uh, which I will also play. Um, hopefully I can get some more in here too. Uh, I like these, they're fun. I like horror games. Um, they're fun to play. Good little games, good stories. Good stuff. Mad Father. Bum bum bum. Northern Germany. Travis residence. Hello. Father. Father, are you in there? Father. Aya. How many times have I told you not to come down here? Sorry, Father. But, um, I'm too scared to sleep on my own. Aya. Uh, don't worry, you're never alone. Your late mother is always there at your side. She's always watching over you, Aya. Okay, now please, get to bed. Yes, Father. Good girl. Father, tomorrow's, yes, the anniversary of her death. We'll visit her grave together. Okay. Now get back to bed, please. I'll be resting too shortly. Okay. S stop. No. Ah! Help me. Help. Uh. I know Father's secret. My father is a scientist. He loves research and is always locked up in the lab in the basement. And I've always heard things from that lab. Animal and human screams. Even at a young age, I knew what my father was doing. Though I pretended I wasn't looking. That I didn't know or hear anything. I feigned ignorance the whole time. Because I loved Father. It's not the only secret I know. When Mom and I went around, he and his helper, Fine, Sam. I shall dispose of the remaining materials myself. That can wait. Come, Rita. Doctor. Doctor. That's so wrong. The mistress is aware of our relationship. What does it matter? I don't believe she's fond of me. That is the problem. 
The girl of the eleventh suit. The troublesome age, to be sure. Be kind to her, please. Ensure that she never comes to harm. She's my most precious... It's midnight. Today's the day Mom went to heaven. Mom. <sighs> now that I'm thinking about Mom, I can't get to sleep. Oh, here we go. Your favorite doll. The doll I got from Father. It's so old and worn. I brought you a present, Aya. Yay, it's a doll! Thank you, Father! That was a little creepy. What a pretty doll! It's almost like it's real. Maybe it is real. Hmm? Hmm? A plane dresser. Horace the traitor, the red-eyed stranger. Hey, huh? something fell out. What's this? Got gem. Gems are hidden in various places. Some require doing special events to get. You can see your gem count in the menu. Find them all and... Yeah, I'm not aiming to get all of them. Fair warning. I'm here for the story. Snowball and the pet rabbit. A portrait of mom. Mom. What should I do, Mom? I do love Father, but... She scares me. She's always looking at me with those eyes. I hate her. But I know Father likes her. If Father and her got married, I guess she would be my new mom. I don't want her to be my mom. I don't need a new mom. There's only one mom in the world for me. Mom, why did you have to go? The room feels cold all of a sudden. I'm kind of scared. I should get back to bed. Okay, little girl. Good night. Good night, self. You sing so well, Aya. Can I turn around now, Father? Just a moment. Just put this here. Yes, it's finished. A flower crown? Does it look good on me? Yes, I think it suits you well. Yay! Thank you, Father. I'm sorry I can't always play with you. Father. It's all right. I'm glad I could play with you today, Father. Oh my! You two are playing! Mom! Look, Father made me a flower crown! That's wonderful! It looks great on you, Aya! So you played with him all day? Yeah. We should do this again, Father. Yes, we should. Next time your mother should join in. Well, I look forward to it. <coughs> Mom, I I'm sorry. Just another fit. <laughs> Don't push yourself if you're not feeling well. Come, get some medicine from Maria. It should help you get better. No, I can get that myself. Mom, are you hurt? You're okay, right? Sorry to worry you. I'm perfectly fine. Don't look so anxious, please. Aya, your smile keeps me going, best of all. If I can't see you smiling, it only makes me worry. Mom. Okay. Now let's get back for dinner. I made sirloin steak tonight. Your favorite, Aya. Hooray! I love Mom's steaks. Right, Father? <laughs> of course. Her steaks are the best in the world. Okay. 
take a wrong stick. We were so happy then. There was Maria too, but even so, the three of us were a happy family. But then Mom passed away from illness, and that happiness we had then, well... Ah! Huh? That scream, Father? Something must have happened. I'll go check on Father. I have a bad feeling. What's the sound? Is it a voice? <coughs> Hello. <laughs> Hi. Oh. No. No, don't. This way. Who's that? Over here. Is there somebody there? Who are you? This way. Really, who? Stay with me. I said this way. <laughs> ah. Yeah? Who's that? Many interesting books in this room. Do you like books, my dear? Who are you? Now, don't be so aggressive. I'm merely a salesman. A salesman? Call me Oka. I hope to get you to know you, young lady. But it's quite troublesome. I think that corpses is the way to turn around the house. Corpses? Those monsters back there? They're like creatures from a story. Why would monsters like that suddenly- Well, it's a curse. What you saw were the corpses of your father's test subjects. Overcome with anger, those deceased have been brought back by the power of a curse. To take revenge on your father. Of course. What? So father's in danger? I have to save him. Why is that? Toward his own ends, he has killed countless people as part of his experiments. This is retribution. You must have realized by now your father's true nature. And yet, you wish to save him? My, my. Perhaps you cannot yet understand their suffering. I have to go save father. A crow? Okay, so that is where I'll be ending this first episode. Um. I might make them longer as they go on, but I think it's just a good place to stop. Um, I'm going to continue on from here, but until then, I will see y'all next time.